Hello, it's Johnny. Uh, today I'm doing a comparison between the Sun Founder, the 10.1 inches IPS LCD monitor made for Raspberry Pi and other projects. And this one is a security monitor and it's also 10.1. And I want to compare it uh, to see what's the difference. The price right now, the difference is $6. Uh, this one was like uh, give you like 5% uh, off. Uh, in Amazon right now and this one is selling for $99 so after shipping this and you know after tax it's about five six dollar differences in prices so I went and got this one because this one have a better resolution this one have uh, this one is already open okay and right now uh, Sega Genesis uh, is plugged in and this one is have a 1280 by 800 resolution so this one have a, a better resolution than that one I think that one is only uh, 10 uh, 1080 1080 by 600 on that one but that one is very heavy uh, it's uh, actually metal so if I was to put a, a magnet like a, like this one is a it's a speaker that have a magnet that is stuck together so if I was to test, see this one stuck to the metal. If I was to put this right here, it does uh, stuck on. It's not plastic, it's metal. And one thing good about this one is that the price is a little bit cheaper and it have a, a video output and it have a BCN output as well for the you know, special camera and HDMI connection and also uh, a video connection and use uh, DC power it does come with two speaker and those are BNC and then uh, USB I guess you could charge a USB power coming out from here and uh, audio video from here uh, but there's no head, head jack okay uh, neither one of them have a head, head jack on the, this uh, this this product, uh, the monitor, the 10 inches monitor. Uh, but when you first turn on, you have to press this button. Otherwise, you're not going to get the correct. Now, if I was to turn this wheel high, that's the loudest it get. Both of them have a speaker in the back. So I'm going to go ahead and open this one as well. And we're going to take a look. Uh, the video on that screen is very good. If you was to look at, uh, this is an IPS screen, so if you was to look at it sideways, let me just bring it back out here. If you was to look at sideways, it's very clear. Top is very good. Bottom is very good. And as well as the size. So this is the type of monitor I would like to put on my RK1UP countertop. But this is a little bit bigger this actually measure a little bit wider than than I uh, participate in because uh, the RK one up for the generation 2 the screen is only uh, the Y is only eight and a half for the Pexi glass and this one right now I measure uh, 8.75 instead of eight and a half so this one even I take the metal case out, this would be too big for the RK countertop, RK one up countertop. I probably have to use this for the Gen uh, Gen one instead of Gen two, because Gen two this screen is too big. Okay, but that's the loudest it get on the sound. Now, if you was to use a Raspberry Pi, you will have to get a, a, a amplifier like this, and then. Uh, and then a cable to convert this to and also you will have to buy a, a power this one did not come with a power okay this you have to buy this and then you have to you know plug in a speaker why not have two small speaker plug into it just for test purpose and I went and bought some different one too and they're pretty loud just for the speaker why not it's just using a speaker that coming from that that e, e yo yo I call it e, e yo yo because I don't know how to really pronounce that. It's E and then uh, Y-O-Y-O, yo-yo. 
and this one is by the Sun Founder. I've been purchased from this company for a while. Uh, most of my uh, uh, Raspberry Pi update. So this is the one that I recommend, but the price is high. It used to be a uh, little bit cheaper, like a uh, under hundred, but now this one is like uh, more expensive. So I'm going to fast forward the speed to unbox it, and then we're going to uh, compare it, see which one is better. You know, by turning the sound real high, see which one is better. Okay, by turning this one all the way up, that's the loudest you get. I just unbox this one and we are going to measure the differences. Uh, one thing cool about this one is if you are buying it for Raspberry Pi, it does come with a Raspberry Pi 4 case and this version is for Raspberry Pi 4. I think they don't make Raspberry Pi 3 anymore for this particular one. And it does come with a mini cable so you could plug this directly from top to Raspberry Pi 4 which is pretty cool because uh, right here you're looking about you know five or six bucks just to get a cable you know and then this convert cable this is for the power for the Raspberry Pi so you could plug this directly to Raspberry Pi as well so and it also come with a camera where you can hook up a camera to the top and it also come with the heat sink three heat sink for the Raspberry Pi which I thought that was pretty cool okay and we're gonna move this to the back and I'm gonna go ahead and plug this directly over and then we're gonna compare this uh, the quality of sound so you could hear the difference right away and then after that we're going to see the so I'm gonna unplug it directly and I'm gonna plug it directly on top I think this one have an option where you could plug to the top or oh, no just yeah just the top then you turn the power on I don't think this outlet that I plug in have power because definitely it's not giving me power right now. There you go. So one thing I think I don't like is the power is directly on top, but I guess because Raspberry Pi is right here, so you you plug it this to the top. All right. So let's now this one you don't have to press anything automatic will. Detect it when you detect it when you plug it in, and let's look at the sideway. Not bad. Bottom, good. Top, good. Size, good. So the screen is good. All right. So let's see how loud this thing will get. This one also have two speaker. It come with two speaker as well. So if you don't want to get an amplifier, you can use a speaker that come with this. Same with that one. But that one, the sound is not very loud.
So you can hear the difference right away when I unplug it and plug it to this one. Okay, so as you could as, as you could hear it, the this one have a better quality in sound. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at uh, what it has. Let's go ahead and turn the sound down. Okay, this one also have two speaker, even though the speaker is right next to each other. The speaker is not that big, it's around this side and this side. So there's two speaker in here, because I opened this before, so I know there's a two speaker in here. Okay, and the control is right here on the right side. And then here is your computer video, and then uh, HDMI, and then the power to uh, Raspberry Pi or any device and then there's the power and that's pretty much it and then Raspberry Pi is right here you hook it up right here and then it come with uh, the camera that you can hook up to it okay. so and it's, it's slanted 65 degree and there's the, the power for the Raspberry Pi where you plug in here and then here's the case here's the case for the Raspberry Pi so you could uh, so you can put the Raspberry Pi over here. And then here's the camera where you can put the camera right here. Okay. So that's pretty cool. All right. So based my opinion, I still like this one better. Now let's go ahead and measure the, the size wise so we could compare the size. Okay. All right. So Based on the size, that one is big, is long, is longer, and based on this screen size, this is eight and a half. So this one will be exactly fit perfectly onto it, maybe, but because it's eight and a half, so possibility will fit on the smaller uh, Jing two, the RK one up, and the length is is five point four. This one is is five instead of 5.4 is five so this one is longer and this one is a little bit more wider so for for raspberry pi this one's a little bit wider and this is shorter this is probably more better and perfect for counter counter cat uh, mod for rk1 up that one is longer and that one will probably for uh for rk1 up generation one like Dig and Dug, uh, Centipede, and uh, Space Invader. That would want that one would be good for that one. This one would be like Pac Man Anniversary, 40, 40 Anniversary, uh, Mrs. Pac Man, and Fogger. Those would be good for uh, for this one, I believe so. Uh, let's measure the diagonal. Diagonal. This is is a ten point one. And this one is also 10.1. So the both diagonally is the same exact diagonal screen. Uh, this one feel like there's a little bit, uh, I think because the screen, uh, you have a screen protection on this one, this one you don't. Uh, it come without screen protector. I don't believe, I don't believe it come with a screen protector. Let's check it out. Yeah, it doesn't come with a screen protector on it so when you open you'll be very careful not to damage your screen because you do not have a screen protector on it this one come with right here is a there's a screen protector so you could peel it off so it look kind of a little bit darker maybe but you could adjust the color 
Uh, this one is easier to take it apart because everything is plastic. So you just take the screw out and you can take this apart. I have a, a video that actually took this apart and show you how it looked like when you, you take everything apart. I in I used the seven inches for the Sonic that I, that I bought that I built it was only like a I think it's a five inches screen or oh, seven inch no seven inches screen and this is a ten point ten point one screen so hopefully I'm gonna try to use this one for Pac-Man for, for 40 anniversary hopefully this will work and that one I'll use it for the uh, maybe Dick and Doug or Centipede because I'm thinking about adding uh, because the, the first generation the arcade stick is wider so you could put more stuff on it so I want to put uh, you already, I already bought a centipede that have a trackball on it so I just need to add a spinner and more button to it so I can play make that one an arcade as well with raspberry pi Alright, so this is just a comparison to let you know what kind of a market price, reasonable price price point to get and what kind of monitor to get. Uh, I recommend getting this one better, but that one will also work, but the price is only $6 difference. So if I, I will probably go get this one before the price go up because 110 this the price, 110 without the 5%, now it's doing 5% because of uh, 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 cyber, cyber holiday cyber week and this one is $99 regular price so it doesn't change or anything all right that's pretty much it thank you for watching hopefully this helped uh, to let you guys know what kind of monitor I'm using to to do my mod so stay tuned for the next uh, video when I do the mod on this uh, Pac-Man generation 2